We just completed our second home in Naperville, and this one is at 1413 North Webster Street. Now before we go inside, I want to point out a couple cool features about this home. We actually have a three-car garage, and it's a true three-car garage, not the tandem area, because we have a 75-foot lot in this home. So that gives you plenty of backyard space as well. You'll also notice it's not your typical cookie-cutter craftsman-style home. We did the brickwork all up the middle to the second level of the home to give it a special feature, as well as the stone around the whole base and a huge front porch as you walk up to the front door. Now this home has tons of lighting and an absolutely gorgeous kitchen that I can't wait to show you, so let's go inside and check it out. One of the things that I like about building on a wider lot is you get to have a nice open space when you first walk into the property, which is what we did on this property, giving you an open staircase with the spindles flowing all the way up to the second level. To my left, we have our den area, which can be used as an office or a nice little living room space. To my right, we have our dining room with the wainscoting along the lower levels and some more custom features with a double layer of crown molding. As we work our way back to the second area of the house from the main level, we have a nice big open area, which could be considered a great room as it combines the kitchen and the big family room. Now, a couple features I want to point out to you in the kitchen area. You'll notice the custom kitchen cabinets from Riverton Cabinetry. We went with the lighter color cabinets up top and the lower color cabinets on the island space and accented it perfectly with a great piece of granite countertop. We also have the KitchenAid appliances with a refrigerator, a double oven, and a really nice stove right in the middle of the kitchen which I absolutely love as it accents perfectly with the glass backsplash. Now our contractors actually found the glass backsplash by mistake and it turned out perfect. Also on this level, on the opposite side, we have our huge family room space with the can lightings, a perfect spot for your TV above the Craftsman style fireplace, and huge windows which looks out to your backyard and your Trex deck. One of the features of a custom home that people always love to talk about is the staircase. Now with this staircase, we were able to give the open concept with the spindle railings wrapping around this whole hallway area, so it gives it a nice bright feel to it and people are going to love it. Back behind me, we have our master bedroom. In the master bedroom, we have the tray ceilings, a huge walk-in closet, and a true master bath. You'll notice in the master bath, we have a giant, oversized shower. We also have a standalone tub, and a double bathroom vanity sink, and a private toilet area, which is always nice. Also in the second level, we have three bedrooms. The first bedroom being a private bedroom, which could be considered a second master suite, or perfect for a guest room, as it has its own bathroom area with a big, soaker tub. The second two bedrooms are the Jack and Jill bedrooms, which combine the bathroom with a stand-up shower in between and their own private vanity. And they both look stunning with all the custom tile work that you could imagine. 